You brown. You brown until Marvel. Hey. Hey. Wish the best today and every day. Happy birthday. Love you, mom. To the moon and back. Hey. My face breaking out. I don't know why. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, we ain't seen y'all in the. Y'all see, I got my world up with me today. There we go. He said hi. Y'all see him hi. <laughs> a vloggy vlog. Another video. Oh, what else? Oh, I gotta find me a bell to put on this video. What? Y'all hear my baby? Y'all better. He ain't coming to play no games with y'all, okay? He's trying to let you all know that his mama is on a road to success, baby. Uh, let me put my seatbelt on because that's the beeping noise. Safety first. <laughs> I had to get my thoughts together, you guys. Um, yeah. You can't forget safety first. Can't forget safety first. You know what? I tried this little matte lipstick today. I'm going to be honest with you. I had it for a long time. I don't like this lipstick color. It's horrible. I'm wearing my natural hair because now it's the fall. We rolling into the fall, the cold weather. Um, Y'all probably saw a lot of braids on me and stuff. I like the braids. I do. I like to, I like to rock the braids in the summertime. That way I don't have to really be doing too much to my hair and worrying about it <sighs> looking all crazy. But now, like the wind, like the, um, the, um, fall autumn y'all know yeah, that type of stuff now now we get into that type of weather i want to start back wearing my hair down and just wearing my natural hair i've started going back to my girl that's gonna get me right she about to get me get my let my length coming back it's already she she cut me up but uh it's going back real fast coming in real good so um i'm just gonna be rocking my hair like this probably for the the rest of the the rest of the year most definitely um, and then yeah see how that works but I just wanted to come on here really really quick y'all to say what's up and to let you guys know that I am about to start back um, bringing videos like um, I got I had like I said I had to take a mental break I had to get my thoughts together I wanted to like write some stuff down and just kind of figure out like what type of direction I want to go with my channel because my ultimate goal is to be a successful YouTuber and um, <clears throat> I appreciate the people who are following me who like my videos who actually watch my videos but I want to start bringing content that is a lot more interesting like you know just I just want to start getting in the habit and getting comfortable with me looking in the camera and bringing it everywhere and stuff like that. So I just want to check in with y'all. We are actually on our way to the store. Today is my husband and his daddy's birthday. So uh, we uh, did a little uh, dinner celebration over the weekend. Um, don't say that. <laughs> anyway. Uh, I got a, um, we got a cake, so we got to go pick up the cake. We actually had a little dinner celebration for him over the weekend. We invited some friends out. Shout out to the people that came out to celebrate with him. I really appreciate it. Um, but today we're just going to take it easy, chill. He had to work today. Um, and it's like the first time in a long time that he had to work on his birthday. My husband does not work on his birthday. More than likely he is on vacation, but he couldn't get a vacation. <laughs> it's, um, yeah. So we just about to go pick up the cake, um, run some other errands. I normally decorate like the kitchen and stuff like on our birthdays. I like to decorate our kitchen, put like balloons up and stuff like that. So I don't like this truck right here. I do not like this truck and I'm about to let him go. But yeah, I know I'm about to decorate the kitchen and stuff. You know, just make it like real. You know, like the, like a vibe. I'm, I'm gonna record it and show y'all this. It don't really be nothing too big, like a tablecloth, and you know, put the cake and the gifts and stuff on the table. So, yeah, we're gonna do that today. But other than that, that's it. That's all we got planned, chilling, um, and do back to reality. So, yeah, I will catch up with y'all later when we go into the store to go pick up the cake and then do our other errands. Come here. Come here. That's it. 
get out. Hold the tin. Huh? Hold the tin. And I... Let's see how long I get out. One, two, Daddy wants to eat for his birthday. Hey y'all, we back at home. I had to cut the video short in the grocery store. Cause y'all know how kids be. Kids do not like going to the grocery store. And I don't blame them because I don't really like, I ain't no big fan of the grocery store either, but yeah, kids be tripping in the grocery store. So I'll just cut it short. Then you gotta go to the bathroom. Y'all kids do that. Like you had to go to the bathroom. Oh my God. Like I have a urinal in my store cause he, he has to go to the bathroom all the time. So, I bought a urinal off of Amazon just for him because I'm like, look, we're not about to keep using these public restrooms. But it's just like, he, he'll use it sometimes, but then other times he'll just be like, all right, mom, forget what you're talking about. Half the time, I just know he'd be trying to be nosy. Like, I know my baby, he just want to be nosy. So, that's why he'd be wanting to go to the bathroom. But I'd be like, who want to be nosy in the bathroom? Like, that's... He just want to be nosy and just be wanting to move around and stuff. As if us walking around a grocery store ain't enough already. But anyway, yes, we are back home. And as I told y'all earlier, today is my husband's birthday. So, um, I like to decorate the kitchen and stuff. Nothing too much. Like, I just like to throw a little tablecloth or something on the table. I got some balloons and stuff. So, I'm going to show y'all how I do that real quick. Like I said, it's really nothing too fancy. Like... I already got the happy birthday up there, as y'all can see it, because um, my birthday was October 15th. My son's birthday was 9-29, September 29th, so my mom decorated the kitchen for my birthday. And I never took it down. I said, well, we got three back-to-back -back birthdays, so I might as well just leave it up. So I just left it up. I'm going to straighten it out a little bit. Uh, but other than that, that's it. I was going to show y'all what I got from the grocery store. Um, I had to get a Pepsi. <laughs> it's a drink. Um, this is the fish fry that I end up getting a fish. My husband been wanting some catfish, so although he had catfish the other day, I didn't make it, so I'm going to find him some catfish today. Hopefully he like it. I end up going with this seasoning here. I showed y'all this. This is Miss Dash, but I got some other seasoning I'm going to use. I did get this little small thing of olive oil because I got a big one in there. I just wanted to make sure that I had just enough just in case. Um, I did end up getting this DiGiorno uh, crispy pan pizza because my son is not going to eat no fish. So, I'm going to put this on for him. Hopefully, he um, eat that. And then I did get a small thing of this Blue Bunny ice cream, the vanilla bean. Um, I don't really eat too much cake and ice cream. I, I eat cake, but I'm, I don't really eat it with my ice cream. So, I know that my in-laws are coming over and my father-in-law, he loves ice cream and cake. Like, he got a real big sweet tooth. So, I figured nobody's really going to eat it. So, I got a small one, but I'm going to put y'all up on something that y'all probably already know about it. Um, it's so old. It's really not nothing I'm putting y'all up on, but this is what I eat with my ice cream. If y'all ain't had Salenti and it got to be the, su the Southern Butter Pecan, oh, I don't know what y'all missing. Like, I don't want no, uh, I don't want no vanilla ice cream with my, with my cake. I don't want no vanilla ice cream. For what? I don't want no vanilla ice cream. I want some of that. Like, that's uh, that right there, man. When I tell y'all, y'all got it. Y'all got to have it. Y'all got to try it. Like, we already know what the vanilla and the ice cream 
but the cake tastes like. Try something new. I will never eat vanilla ice cream with my cake again. It's always going to be that. I did end up getting two packs of catfish. Um, I think it's two in each pack. And then I got some catfish nuggets too. So I'm going to see how this going to work out. I'm not really hungry. I'm probably not going to eat no catfish. Um, I'm not really a big fish eater either. So that's probably going to be all of them. My husband's favorite colors, well, all our favorite colors, honestly, are uh, red and black. So I'm just going to go to the dollar store. Got some red plates. Um, I got some clear cups. Um, what else did I get? That's what I get. Oh, I know this really ain't gonna match with our, um, uh, this ain't gonna really match with the cake. I'm gonna show y'all the cake, too, that I got. I'm gonna tell y'all the story about the cake, too. That kind of ticks me off, but I'm gonna tell y'all the story. I just got to these bags. I'm gonna put his gifts in a bag, which I really, I'm still waiting on some stuff to come in. I do this crap every year. Like, I wait till the last minute to order his stuff, and then it'll never be here for his birthday. I'll be feeling so freaking bad. But I end up getting this right here, red tablecloth. Um, I just got some plastic red uh, silverware. I got to fill our cars out, and then I got this here. Black, since red and black is our favorite color. Well, his favorite color is his birthday. I'm going to put the uh, black down first and then the red. So, it look like red and black. And then these are our cards. I got to feel like the all stores don't sell it. Because I really don't know. But this right here, Oberweiss, Oberweiss, I think is how you say it. They got the lemonade. And then this is the uh, fruit punch right here. Best juice ever. Like, it's juice. It's better than Mad Bay. Better than... Uh, Ohana, whatever y'all be drinking, whatever, whatever. I'm gonna tell you something. They lemonade is even better than this crap right here. Man, I don't like this crap. This is just awful. That's awful. So, this right here, I'm gonna drink this. I'm gonna drink that. We are, we drink, we are heavy fluid drinkers. We like to drink a lot of water and juice and stuff like that. So, um, what else did I get? today my son like these little things right here <laughs> he like noodles anyway so i guess master p got these little uh noodles or whatever so my son those are what be he is and then these are the candles that i got for the cake now i know dog on one of these candles don't match nothing this cake i'm gonna show y'all this cake and you're gonna be like him why would y'all get them why would you get them silver why would you do that I got them because I like them, and that's what Olivia's oil that handles. I like them, and then plus they had no, um, they had no. I'm so sick of them little cheap letters, a little standard, little can number, little number, the little dots and stuff. I'm sick of them, so I just want to try something new. But let me bring y'all over here to this cake, and I got a story for this. I'm gonna try to flip it around so y'all can see it here. Okay, that's the cake right there. Now on the cake, it says it's a one fourth marble sheet cake with vanilla icing and then it's filled with like um like strawberry in the inside i didn't even know you could do that until my husband got my cake my husband likes myers cake we have a bakery here that everybody likes it's a few bakeries but the bakery that we always go to is sweetheart bakery um if you're not familiar with sweetheart bakery um you gotta try it they're good they have declined since I was little, when I was little, my family used to always go there. But now, it they kind of declined a little bit. And I really have to excuse me. I'm going to just sit y'all right here with a refrigerator at. And that's it. I'm going to talk to y'all from this angle. Let's talk about this cake while I get this kitchen again. Okay. I got When you go, everybody knows that when you want a cake that is... If you want a fresh cake, right? Everybody knows that you have to call and place an order for the cake. I don't have a problem with that. So, I called, placed an order for the cake. I called over the phone. Big mistake. I believe should have called and went up there like I normally do. But I was trying to be lazy. So, I called over the phone. wanted. it. A cake that feeds 30 to 40 people because I had a dinner for my husband over the weekend. 
there were not like there were maybe about 15 people that showed up to the dinner that was enough we would have still had some cake left over boom boom bam i told her that i wanted vanilla not vanilla i wanted whipped icing on it half and half chocolate and vanilla after we got done with all of that she asked me what colors did i want i told her that i would like the colors the the happy 38th the wording in red i said do it in red with a red and black border around the cake not balloons or roses hmm I told her, give me balloons because I'm like, okay, you can do like balloons at the top and rolls at the bottom. Whatever y'all do, freak it out. It doesn't matter. This cake I called in on Wednesday, last Wednesday. Last Wednesday was November 1st. The cake would have been ready on that Saturday, November 4th. I asked her over and over, is that enough time for you all to get that cake together? She said, yeah. No problem. More than enough time. Fine. Perfect. Good. I didn't think I had to put too much, you know, into it. I'm like, fine. Cool. That's good. Let's go ahead and make it. So, she makes the cake or whatever. Gave me a price. I'm like, okay, cool. So, um, Saturday comes rolling around. Our dinner is scheduled for 7 o'clock. They told me the cake I could pick up at 1 o'clock. I was fine with that. I had some errands to run. Woo, woo, woo. Boom, boom, boom. Let's go. Pick up the cake. There is a guy there. I tell him, you know, hey, I'm here to pick up a cake. Woo, woo, woo. This is the name. He goes in the back to look for the cake. He brings out a white box with the name Kim on the side. That is how it looked when he brought me the cake. I'm like, okay, bet. He walks away. I, like normal people, you want to look at your cake because you want to make sure, you know, that you got everything you want on your cake. I get the cake. The cake had martini glasses on there, a picture of martini glasses, and it had cheers, something cheers, something. And then on the border of the cake, it said happy birthday or happy, yeah, happy anniversary or happy birthday auntie. Remind you, I told this guy that this is a birthday cake for my husband. This very soft-spoken tone young man walks away. Give me my cake, walk away. I told him, sir, please come back here. Turn around, come back. He came back. I said, this is not my cake. Now, to most of you all, you probably are like, okay, big deal or whatever. They messed up her cake. Or they gave her the wrong cake. He probably, y'all thinking, oh, he probably gave her the wrong cake. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. I told him this is not my cake. He proceeds to go into the back and look for my cake. Hmm. Five or ten minutes roll by. He's still walking back and forth looking for my cake. No cake in his hand. I'm like, okay. So I ask him, is everything okay? You know, he comes and tell me that... It doesn't look like they made the cake. Okay, they didn't make my cake. I'm like, okay. So you mom, you can go and pick out a cake that's already made. I can put my hand, I can write on the cake, but my handwriting is not the best. I'm gonna say that for y'all one more time. The cake was not made. The slip is lost. I cannot find the slip. You are more than welcome to go and pick out a cake that is already made. I can write on the cake, but my initials are not the best. My handwriting is not the best. I apologize. Okay. His handwriting is not the best. So, handwriting not the best. Cake is lost. Nobody made the cake. Boom, boom, boom. We can't find it. It's one o'clock, dinner stars in, uh, what, maybe four or five, six hours. I gotta go home, get ready. I got people expecting, I'm expecting people to come. I'm expecting some cake. So, the thing that really, really, really bothered me was the fact that he was really okay 
with me not having my cake. And for me, going to pick out a cake that was already made. He wanted me to go pick out a cake that was really already made. So I don't know how long, I don't know how those, how that works because I've never worked in a bakery before. So I really don't know how all of that works. You know, it, 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 those cakes could have been something that y'all made from yesterday, two days ago. I don't know. Now, to y'all, it's probably not a big deal. It's a cake, Kim. They lost the cake. They didn't make it. They ignore it happens. It's a big deal. It's a big deal. Before I got married, cake was just cake to me and my family. Like, it was just cake. Me and my mama, it was just cake. You know, it was just literally like, honestly, it was just cake. I keep saying it, but it was just cake. When I got married, I never knew how important cake was until I got married. So, when I tell you guys that you got to come with your A game, with birthday cakes, anniversary cakes, any type of cake, holiday cakes, it ain't no sleeping on the cakes on this side no more. We ain't sleeping on no cakes. We can't. There's no sleeping on these cakes. Like, you got to be able to step your cookies up when you getting a cake made over on this side of the woods. So, I put in for another cake. You know, I was talking to my good friend, and she told me, she said, Kim, just, um... Because I asked her, I told her the situation, and she said, well, Kim, you know, just leave the cake at home, or, you know, don't, don't even love the cake. She told me before all of this happened to not even bring the cake. She said, don't even bring the cake, because it's going to be extra stuff to love. I'm like, you know what? Yeah, you're right. So, I'm going to just, you know, just wait. I'm going to just wait. I'm not going to even... You know, blood the cake or bring the cake to the place or with us or whatever. I'll just save the cake. I'll save it for his actual birthday. So I told the manager, because there was a manager that ended up coming, because he looked through the pile as if he was going to find it. Nothing. He couldn't find anything. So um, I told him, and I don't know if this was wrong. I said, you know, I'm not going to take the cake to the restaurant anyway. So I didn't eat the cake before Tuesday. You know, you guys dropped the ball on it. There's nothing that you all can do. Nothing that could be done at this point because I'm not taking one of these cakes that's already made. I'm just, I don't want that. That's not what I wanted. So I really need the cake for Tuesday. That's the actual birthday. Just had a cake for Tuesday. The manager words to me were, okay, thank you for understanding. Understanding what, sir? Because at this point, you guys owe me a free cake. I want a free cake. Yeah, I'm taking it all the way there. I want me a free damn cake. Needless to say, I didn't get no free cake. But I did get a hell of a discount off of this cake here. Now, a little story about this cake here. At the beginning of the story, I told you all that I wanted half and half. Half chocolate, half white. Some people eat chocolate, some people eat white. You know, so I have to get half and half. Um, This label on this cake says marble. It says marble. So the guy that handed me the cake today, totally different guy, I said, this cake say marble. I said, what did that slip say? I was like, can you go back and get that slip? He was nice enough. He went back, got the slip, read the slip. He said, it says half and half white. It says chocolate and white. I said, okay. So if I cut this cake and this cake is marble, we're going to have an issue. Meyer, count your days. Count your days, because you didn't already messed up. You didn't mess up the first order. I know y'all not going to mess this up again. Y'all really not going to mess this up again. I don't be understanding why people can't just get stuff right. Like, what is the issue? Just get it right. You know, I'm I, like I said, I've never been one of those people that just cause a big scene or cause a fuss about things. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Like, damn, it's just a cake. Okay, woo, woo, whatever. I ain't going to make no big fuss about it, but... I do expect, you know, for, you know, I want stuff the way I want it. Like, I want stuff the way I want it. Like, if I if I asked you for, you know, a specific color cake or a specific flavor cake, yeah, that's what I want. I want that. If I asked you for a, something specific on this cake, that's what I want. I want that. You know? I don't don't have that me. Don't have that me. So, for y'all, so for, for anybody that's talking about, oh, okay, that's the cake or this and that, yeah, okay. Okay. Y'all go ahead and order y'all uh, a, a 30 inch bus down. And then if I come with you with a 10 inch, you're going to be mad, right? Right, 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 right. 
That's what I'm saying. So, mm -mm, I ain't going for it. So, so far, I'm not thrilled about this cake I got either. Because I don't like the handwriting on this cake. I hate the handwriting on this cake. Like, the handwriting is awful. I'm going to show it to y'all again. It's just awful to me. I'm just doing something really quick. Like I said, this is something just quick to put this stuff out and get everything. This probably looks like a little Halloween. Looking at this uh, tablecloth through the camera, it, uh, it look orange, orange. <laughs> yeah, as I'm looking at this, it look a little orange, but it's okay. You know, men are not like women. Like, they don't be really doing all of that. Like, my husband could probably care less about what I got going on on this table. Like, on this. He could care less. <laughs> That's just how men are. Since then, I, then I can't speak for all men. I have to just speak for some men. Um, some men are different. Some men, they do care. You know, I'm not going to say he don't care. I know he's appreciative. But... He's going to care more about this dinner. Because he's been at work all day. So he's going to care more about this food than anything. Like, where the food and the cake at? At this point. <laughs> so I have to see if his mom and dad is still coming over. Um, here. My friend was nice enough to buy me these uh, flowers here for my birthday. I love these flowers. And they, when she bought me these flowers, these flowers were so beautiful. They were so, so, so beautiful. Now, yeah, I'm going to throw these out. Because I got some other ones that are um, red and black. So I'm going to throw these out here. I'm sorry about throwing my set up. On my side. I have something on them too. I had these for uh, I had this since October. I had this since October. trying to get no I'm not trying to eat no marble cake so we're gonna see I got a, I got some cleaning up to do y'all like I got some real 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 major cleaning up so I'm gonna show y'all not show y'all but I'm gonna just bring y'all along while I clean up and straighten up my kitchen real quick Yeah. 
Smile.